Okay, guys, I am back again, still keeping you updated with what is going on in Nigeria. So I have this video to share with you guys. Uh, but before then, wherever you are, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I hope we all are doing uh, just fine. So um, the video you are seeing on your screen, I don't want to waste your time. Um, it's a video. This happened in Abuja today. Uh, where cows... Okay, you can see those cows there, okay? Uh, let it not be as if I am framing it. You can see the video. I will allow you to listen to what these people are saying. When people talk about this, when Nigerians cry about this, those people in support of this feels there is nothing wrong. When the southern governors came together um you know, to decide on anti-open grazing. Some of them, because of their political interests, imagine one of the governors saying that um, uh, in his state, there is nothing like a anti, there is no law like anti-open grazing and so on. Now, this happened in Abuja. Cow, just caused an accident. Now, you can see, because of politics, some of the southern governors, I, I, I really recommend um, Akere Dulu, on the state governor. Um, I think Enugu state um, governor has also signed uh, the anti-open grazing and some other governors, okay? A lot of people is commending them for that. How I wish the southern governors will come together, realizing that it is not about politics. I keep telling people, if we look beyond our political interests, Nigeria will be five steps ahead. Like, serious. How do you explain this to people? A country of 200 million people. Cows is still a number one citizen. Dare you touch this cow and see what will happen? Yes. You dare not touch this cow. That just caused an accident. Okay, you can see. That is um, a Corolla car, I guess. I believe so. You dare not touch this cow and go scot-free. Believe me, if you do anything silly, you end up in jail because you just hurt number one citizen. This is what everybody is crying for, but yet they believe there is nothing wrong. Now, after the um, Ondo State Governor signed the anti-open grazing into law, the chairman of Mietiala, I think that was... um. Arise Television, openly told uh, Makere Dulu that it will not change anything. For the fact that southern governors have signed the anti-open grazing, those of them that signed, okay, that it will not change anything. And Mieti Allah give reference to what happened in Benue State. Okay, so what happened in Benue State that though Benue State signed the anti open grazing into law, but they have no peace that it's not going to change anything. Can you imagine? Can you imagine that is a very serious threat? I don't know if it's a threat, but imagine coming to national television to give a governor, you know, that that sounds like a threat. That's for the fact that you signed the um, anti open grazing that. It doesn't mean that there will be peace in your state. That is a very big threat. But believe me, those are the same people that will relax in their home this night. But there you talk about insecurity. The following day, you'll be invited. Now, this is what everybody is crying about. Can you imagine? Without wasting much of your time, uh, let me know what you guys think as I share this video. For you guys. See you guys in another video. Hey, come, down, come, down, come down, come down, come down, come down. Cow, co cow caused this accident right now. Cow. Cow caused this thing. See them. See them. On on highway. Cow caused the cow caused this thing. Cow caused this thing. My God. What 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 is this? Cow caused this. Let's go, let's go. 